Hi guys, it is Derek here at Safari Niagara coming to you with a very special video today about what is happening on April 8th. You probably already know what I'm talking about, the total solar eclipse. Now, a total solar eclipse is actually when the moon passes in front of the sun in such a perfect way that it actually blocks the sun out temporarily, usually for a couple of minutes. And being at Safari Niagara, you might be thinking, what about the animals? How does this affect them? The short answer is that this is the first time Safari Niagara has been in the direct path of totality. Uh, so this is going to be the first time that we have the full experience of the total solar eclipse. But thankfully, a lot of other zoos across North America have experienced this and we can certainly learn from them. Based on research that was conducted and led by the North Carolina State University in 2017, we can extrapolate their information to our situation uh, and look for any kind of nighttime behaviors, anxiety behaviors, or anything that might be out of the norm for our animals in their daytime routines. So when I say nighttime behaviors, these could include things like birds going up to roost like they do at night, or hippos leaving the body of water that they engage with during the day to find the freshest grass to graze on. Now during a total solar eclipse, darkness will come much, much faster than it would during a normal sunset, just like how the light will return a lot faster than when the sun normally would rise. But while we here at Safari Niagara are ensuring all of our animals are enjoying the celestial event safely, please ensure that no matter what you guys have planned for April 8th, you and your loved ones do so as well. I'm Derek with Safari Niagara. See you soon.